Hello Sim Rally fans. Um, in this video I'm going to talk about the Rally One Hybrid Boost system. Um, I've seen a few posts online and a few of my teammates have mentioned that they haven't quite figured out how to work it yet. So I've had a good few hundred hours on the game and I've managed to figure out the ins and outs of it. So I thought I'd uh, give it a shot and try and explain, to, explain it and talk in a video for once in my life. Um, right, so if we have a look at the tachometer down in the bottom right hand corner here uh, you'll see at the start of every stage the hybrid boost system is ready to go it doesn't need charging it's always 100% charged when you start a stage um, just below that you'll see I've got a nice little overlay that has my throttle steering position and my brake I've also included the percentage a little bit out because the sim hub doesn't fully work with this game I've just mapped my inputs into an idle screen basically um, so we'll talk about the three different positions, or well, three different options for the hybrid boost system. We've got cautious, which is what I'm currently set at now. Um, that has, um, you need to press the threshold 75% in order to activate it. Um, if you look on the left hand side of the tachometer, you'll see that there's a nice little gauge there for you. It's filling up in white. That line is the activation four, deactivation point three, for cautious. Two, um, we'll just launch the car now. We're below it, so we're not boosting. We'll go above it. We're boosting. Go below it. Not boosting. That obviously changes with balanced one, which is about 50%, and aggressive, which is around about 25%. Um, so that's how you can come... Well, how you can activate and deactivate it using the throttle pedal. Now, most people have been complaining well, I say most, some people I've seen online are saying that it's bugged, it's not working uh, for the regen. <laughs> it does work. Um, however, you can't charge the system whilst you're on the throttle and the brakes at the same time. It just doesn't have it. Come off the throttle, it starts charging. Now, I've been doing a few brake tests and it's about 60%, as you see just there, to get it to charge. Just do that again. So at 50, 60. 60 charging. So hybrid boost system is ready to go again. Activate, deactivate, and we're fully charged again. Now, yeah, it's 100% not bugged. It's just different new. We obviously it's going to take a while to get our heads around it. You do have to change your driving style because you have to be 100% certain. You don't have to come off the throttle pedal when you exit the corner when it's active. So it works, it's just going to take some time to get used to. And then once you get used to it, you've got to figure out how to use it tactically to gain an advantage over everybody else, which is really going to interest me, especially when it comes to creating the Rally 1 setups. Um, and I think that pretty much covers anything. If you've got any questions, um, just drop them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them. Uh, thank you for your time. If you found this useful, um, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.